Hi, Zach and Jesse. I'm Dan Sparrow, founder and president of Oberon Electrodynamics based in Jiangsu, China. And we manufacture electric vehicles. I want to talk to you and your viewers about the state of the EV industry here in China and some of the amazing technology that we're coming across every day. We're currently introducing two low-speed vehicles in the U.S. and abroad. First shown here is a five-door mini SUV with 120 kilometer range. It features air conditioning, heat, power windows and remote power locks, full touchscreen infotainment system, front disc brakes, and is legally speed limited to 25 miles per hour or 45 kmh. We begin shipping in Asia and Latin America in March and target a U.S. launch date in May to June 2021. This model shown here is an L6E certified or light quadricycle class micro mobility EV. We're now shipping to Norway, Greece, and Germany. It too features all standard creature comforts and it's built on a steel space frame with plastic body panels to conserve weight. As we're working with many state-of-the-art design and development companies and manufacturing facilities here in China, we've come across a few surprises, including here the ODM manufacturer for candies, K27 and uh, K23 models, you'll see in the background. Um, we're working with them for something we're going to export to the U.S. and to Europe in the near future. And for our product line, we are working with graphene and solid-state battery production, um, hopefully to be integrated into our product mix uh, later in this year. Also want to talk with you, your viewers about the current state of the EV industry in China, including major brands like Geely, Xprong, Baojun, Wuling. I drive a Chinese branded EV myself and I'm going to review my own car in the near future. And I hope to check in with you guys more and discuss everything that's going on here. And now you know.